hello guys good day to you and welcome to today's video on the crypto first channel my name is chukumeka miracle and um, in today's video i'll be showing us how to mint uh the public mint nft on the venom network all right and um, thanks to engineer abimbola Eugenie for helping us out with the update and uh, i decided i with his permission i decided to do this video for those of us using Android, showing us how to go about it. So what I will do is um I'll drop a link to because there are steps you follow. You understand? So I will drop a link to his medium article that uh, lists out and explains how to go about it. So it's that in the steps he, he talked about in that article that I will be following. I already have the article open on my medium page, my medium account here. Right, so let, let's just dive into it. Don't forget to like, what the like, subscribe, and share this video to your friends, your family, and your socials. All right, so this is the article. It's $1,700 airdrop. $1,700 airdrop tutorial on how to meet NFT on DevNet. All right, so let's go. Step one, it says we have to switch to Venom. Look at the step one here. Step one, we have to switch to Venom DevNet Network. It says open up the Venom wallet and select change network. And then let's go. So what you do now is um instead of if you open your this is my Venom wallet over here. Where's my Venom? This is the Venom wallet over here. But if you open the Venom wallet, it won't you won't be able to select network. So what you just do is um you go to your Mrs. Browser. This is my Mrs. Browser over here. Let me let me let me highlight it. This this is the Mrs. Browser. This is the Mrs. Browser. Just go open your Mrs. Browser. If you've watched our previous video on this uh, Venom, you know what Mrs. Browser is. Mrs. Browser is like the default browser that was used for that we used those of us using Android and mobile. Mrs. Browser was what enabled us to partake of doing the NFTs and all the whole thing that they did there. Okay, now. If you go to Mrs. Browser, what did this? What did what is this? It says, uh, "Open up the Venom and select Change Network." Okay. Then says, "Select Change Network." Then after that, click on Settings. So what you do is um, this is my Mrs. Browser here, and on the Mrs. Browser, if you've already done anything with Mrs. Browser on, um, what's it called on Venom, it's already an added extension already. So what you just do is, um, where is it? Where is it? Um, hold up. Click on this. Click on Venom Wallet. You see where I click on? Click on this extension button here. This extension button to open up the Venom Wallet for you. Let me just show you. Now, this is the Venom Wallet. You see, you can see this is my own Venom Wallet. Then you now tap on this. If you tap on this, you now see the various networks available. There's testnet, there's testnet reserve, there's mainnet, there's mainnet reserve, there's local node, CGL, and there's Venom DevNet. Remember what he said in the article? He said, um, hold up, let's it open. This is taking time. Step one he said. Open up the Venom wallet and set, select change network. Then we should put it in DevNet testnet. Okay. After that, click on settings. Then click on add custom network. Okay. So we put it in Venom DevNet. Mine have already done it, so it's on DevNet already. Then click on settings. Settings will open another another um another page that see down below here you can see add custom network if you click on add custom network then it said in the step four after that impute the information as displayed in the photo which includes changing the type to graph ql look at it here. changing the type to graph ql so if you come back here this type it puts it in Change it to GraphQL. All right. Now, network name 
the network name to Venom DevNet. See the name. So what I'll just do for you is I will drop the link. I will copy out this whole article here. I'll just make. I'll keep it. I'll drop it in the description of this video. So it will be very easy for you. Just watch it and as you put as you just follow exactly what I do in the video. What is being done in this video. You understand? And I'll drop the link to his article also. You can as well follow him for more articles and more updates like this. Change the name to Venom DevNet. Already. I added it, but I'm just to do it for this video. DevNet, Venom DevNet, endpoint, enter the endpoint. Okay, this is the endpoint here. This is the URL of the endpoint. It has automatically copied. Then click on copy. I've copied it. Come here and paste it. Paste it. Then that's just all. Then just click on add custom network to finalize it. Um, that is taking time. Okay. It says click, then click on add custom network to finalize it. Got it. All right. So just come here, click on um, this is this button over here. Just add custom network. That's all. Then you see you know, the network has been successfully added. It says switch to this network. After you switch to this network, now I'm already on this Venom. This is the as you can see by it has reflected. To Venom DevNet, okay. So, what's the next thing to do? Wow, why is this thing doing like this? Okay, click on switch to this network. Uh -huh. You have successfully switched to them. Now we can move on to the next step to mint NFT using Venom tokens from the faucet. So, to do this, you go to this is the site over here. Before you do this, I will advise you open a G GitHub account because it's like a prerequisite to open this DevNet faucet. So, I already opened the DevNet uh, a GitHub account yesterday, which is where I had to postpone this video to today. You understand? Just copy this the link. Let me just copy the link. Okay. And um, open a new tab. Open a new tab. I don't want this video to be too long. Open a new tab. Just put in the link. Mm -hmm. see, see, you can see why it is needed, why the um, GitHub is needed. Over here, you can see it says login via github all right i already have a github account so i'll just click on login and um it's, it's loading one submit from one day wow 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 i logged in earlier i logged in earlier let me try again if it will work one submit for one day all right this is not opening for now Probably I'll do another video. This the time now is 10 30 p.m. Maybe by once it's 12 o'clock, I'll do another video and um I'll add it up as an addendum to this other video. So once you just open it, then you just follow these steps here. After logging in, after it will open, you see where it says login with GitHub. After it opens, you see where a space where it is provided for you to put in your Venom wallet address. What you just do it there. You come to this place, you come back to Mrs. Browser, come to your Venom wallet. This address over here. This address over here. No, 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 that's not what I want. This place. This address over here. Just click on this button. Click on this button and you copy it. Now, if you copy it, then you, this place, you come back to the DevNet faucet. If it opens, then you submit it. You see a space for you to submit in the wallet address. After submitting the wallet address, give it a few minutes, about give it a five or ten minutes, then it will reflect in your wallet address. Let me show you my own wallet address. As you can see over here, I have 10 Venom tests, Venom DevNet tokens. This is for the minting of the NFTs, you understand? So that's just basically how it they used to go about it. You get that's just basically they used to go about it. All right, guys, that's just the, all there is to to this video. Once the um you submitted the wallet, then you come to this site over here. 
Oh, okay, look, 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 look. Let me open it. You come to this side over here and you meet the NFT. You meet the NFT you want. You come to this side over here and you meet the NFT you want. Let me see if it's working. The network is acting up. Once you've successfully added um, the wallet address and you've received your Venom DevNet, that the Venom DevNet will serve as um, gas fees and for minting of the NFT. All right, so. Let me see. Wow. Same completed. Same completed. All right. So that's just basically how to go about this thing. You get that's just basically how to go about it. So if you have any confusions, uh, you need que you have questions, you need clarifications, you need you have just whatever it is, do where to drop them in the comment section. All right. Do where to drop them in the comment section. Ask your questions. Thanks for liking. Thanks for sharing our videos. Thanks for posting. And um, till the next update comes around, my name is Chukimeka Miracle, and this is your success in the crypto space. Bye for now.